Hi, this is John Calvert from the Clarkstown Central Public Schools. And this is our $10,000 pyramid-like quiz show game. At the beginning of the game, each team, and this particular version has three teams, but there's another version that has five teams. Each team rolls the dice and records the score that they get. The team with the highest score goes first. Then you proceed to our game board. As the teacher, we want to double click on the categories and rename them. So I'll name this one Popular Authors. Now you might have to uh, scale them or resize the text box to make it fit. Uh, do whatever you need to do. But when the game is played, the team might select Category 6 and be brought to the Category 6 slide. The teacher will want to double click on the Category 6 name text box and rename it. So in this case, Popular Authors. The teacher will also have to edit the uh, text box. Now, when you first get here, this is what you would see. No terms or anything. But think $10,000 pyramid. You have to put popular authors here so that the team can elicit the answers. So what you want to do is you want to hit the edit button and add your terms. So uh, just type them in. And hit OK when you're done. Now, the way this should work, one team member will face away from the smart board, and the rest of the team will face the smart board and get to see the words or the terms as they're clicked off. You should set the timer. I suggest one minute. That's a pretty good time. And the team can pass on a word if it's becoming too difficult. Um, the only people that get to see the keywords is the team members that are trying to elicit the answers. And I recommend that you take turns. So team member one would uh, give a clue, then team member two would give a clue, and so on, until the student on the hot seat can guess the word or passes. If a pass is made, drag down the X box. If they successfully get the word, check it off. When you're done, click on the scoreboard and tally up your score. At the end of the match, once the pyramid is done, figure out who has the most scores, who has the most uh, questions right, and then you can go to the final, that team can go to the final period, pyramid and try their stuff. The final pyramid uh, on the final pyramid board, the teacher has to set these terms as well. So these are question flippers. And if I click it, you'll see that you'll get those the words. Uh, the teacher needs to click on the double arrow on the top left of the question flipper, select the back tab, and put the word that's going to be there. So when the uh, question flipper is selected, the team can try to elicit the student on the hot seat to guess what that word is without saying the word or using hand gestures. You also want to set the timer on this board. If they get uh, the word right, the game master can add the check mark. If they get the word wrong, you get the X. And that is how the $10,000 pyramid is played. I hope you have fun with it.